Brooks is a running company focused on the runner and we create the best running product in the industry. We focus in more on the functional standpoint. So everything that I do, it needs to fall through that filter. Functionality comes first and then the aesthetic wraps around that. Footwear begins from a foundation called the last. The last is a representation of the foot. It's very difficult to design around this shape in 2D because there really isn't any flat lines, straight lines uh, that you can kind of base your drawing off of. In the past, uh, we were sending out blueprints, 2D blueprints, and essentially asking our manufacturing partners to, to create a sculpture, if you will, uh, of representative of the 2D blueprint. We need to go through a phase of actually building a shoe, ordering materials, getting material, getting colors, and building the shoe. And sometimes that process can take uh, two months. And if I can, I can see that in a week, I think that's, I think, a huge advantage. Using uh, 3D modeling software uh, like Moto really allowed us to, uh, to build and to visualize uh, 3D models, or these footwear toolings, uh, prior to them being constructed overseas, really saved us a lot of time, uh, money, and effort. Historically, uh, 3D software has always been difficult, difficult to use. Their user interfaces, you know, you had to be a rocket scientist to, to figure it out. I think Moda has done a really great job with, uh, you know, revising and, and changing up their user interface uh, to really accommodate uh, the designer's needs. You know, a lot of these designers may not have a, a 3D background going in and being able to, to create great digital product uh, within the software quickly and easily is, is very important. If we can get the designers to use it earlier in the process um, to model some of their concepts instead of going through multiple iterations, that would be, that would be the way to go. It, it allows me, instead of maybe just seeing exploring one option, it might potentially give me the chance to explore three options. I mean, that, that is, can be a huge resource. We can adjust colors, we can adjust materials, um, uh, finishes, and this really helps the designer look at the shoe as, as a completed object. I'm really excited to see what 3D can do for the designer to explore things that they can't necessarily come up with by themselves.